Local construction companies are breathing a big sigh of relief. Home construction was at its highest rate in more than four years across the nation for September. Nationwide builders began work on 872,000 new homes, an increase of 15% from August. Applications for building permits, a sign of future construction, jumped nearly 12%, also the highest since July of 2008. And that same trend is playing out in Spokane County. KXY 4's Anusha Roy joins us now live where Condren Homes has been very very busy, Anusha. And this construction is a sight for sore eyes. This company has 10 different projects going on right now. It is a lot of work for the company, but one that's definitely welcome. Every nail and plank is building up the housing industry in Spokane. It's a huge sigh of relief for us. We're, we're excited. It's been a dark time for construction companies in the county as a recession slashed profits, business, and employees. My company went from 23 employees down to four. But all of a sudden, Condren Homes has a lot of work for the handful of people left in the company. They've seen the biggest spike in home sales over the last two months in six years. The depressed housing market has lasted so long, and I think people are just tired of waiting. They're getting off the fence, and consumer confidence, I think, is what's driving this market right now. It's a trend playing out across the county. It is a sign, an encouraging sign for our industry that things are starting to turn around. Not only are building permits up, there's a 31% increase in how much these permits are worth. That means more expensive houses are selling. For every home, built creates on average three and a half jobs and so if you have a hundred homes built there's 350 jobs. Also buyers are realizing that while house prices are going up they're still cheaper so it's time to grab a good opportunity. We're all really happy that this is uh, starting but again we we've uh, been in a deep downturn and now it says uh, there's some glimmers of hope. And with all of this does come growing pains and it appears that a lot of skilled workers have left the area gone for places like Seattle and the oil fields. But now that construction companies are busy again, they're facing this challenge of finding enough skilled workers to keep up with demand. Live in Spokane, Anusha Roy, KXLY4 HD News.